Howdy. Hello. I'm Jesse, and this here is Cassidy. And we were wondering if there might be any place around these parts where two hard-working ranchers, such as ourselves, could stop and rest for the night. There's a motel about a mile up the interstate. I hear it has bed bugs, though. No, 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 you misunderstand me. Somewhere a proper cowboy can rest. With plenty of room for the horses. That's a stick horse. I know that. We're asking if there's anywhere we can camp out. Yeah, and none of that glamping crap. This is real, hard, gritty, living off the land stuff. Dude. It's my mom. Well, put her on hold. You put her on hold. That doesn't even, uh, fine, just, just text her. Just... Okay. Anyways, camping. Uh, there's a campsite about half a mile away, but it gets pretty full this time of year. I said we wanted real camping. Look, you can't just camp in unregulated spaces. That's called being homeless. Is there someone y'all want me to call? My mom's asking if we're gonna be back tomorrow or the day after. Fine, whatever, just just let's go. We'll, we'll find our own spot. Let's ride. It's your turn to take these. Crap. Fine. Those have gotta be the worst goddamn cowboys I've ever seen in my entire life. What should I tell my mom? Tell her the day after. Just to be safe. This isn't working for me. I feel like I'm stealing something from someone else and making it slightly worse. It is really difficult to click those things while writing. Hmm. So, um, what's the plan? I told you, we're camping. Are we cowboys or more like crappy cosplayers? We're cowboys! Okay, well correct me if I'm wrong because you're the one who's into westerns, but Aren't cowboys supposed to have living, breathing horses? We're not ready for real horses. Yeah, because they're terrifying. Or not. Yeah, they have creepy eyes. Look, once we've mastered stick horses and camping and such, we can move up to real horses. Then, once we learn to ride and not die, we'll be ready for cows. Then bing, bang, boom, we got our own ranch. I think you're missing a couple steps. Oh, come on, Cass. Don't you trust me? You coming? Yeah, yeah, coming. There, that should be enough. Okay, awesome. You get the fire started and I'll get the s'more stuff. Oh, uh, what? Absolutely not. Cowboys don't eat s'mores. What? Since when? Uh, since always. Have you ever seen a cowboy eat a s'more? I haven't seen a cowboy ride a stick horse either. I told you, the horses are temporary. Can't the s'mores be temporary? You can break cowboy code if you want but I won't. I don't think the s'mores are a part of cowboy code. It's not authentic in any case. Whatever, start the fire. You start it, you brought the matches. Cass, matches? I thought you brought the matches. What? I thought you had the matches and I was gonna bring the s'mores stuff. We never discussed s'mores. Well, I remember that now. Ugh. Isn't it against cowboy code to use matches? Like, take the easy way out? The matches are not the easy way out. Cowboys had matches. It's fine. I can fix this. I know what to do. Don't tell Gene Autry. Gene Autry is dead, Jess. I did bring it, though. Bring what? Oh, God, Jess, no! 
You're gonna be a desperado! Just please stop! Yeehaw! 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 You could have just asked. Go to sleep. What the heck are you doing? Breakfast? Look, it's not the best breakfast, but the gas station around the corner didn't have any breakfast egg sandwiches. Or any egg sandwiches that I would trust. No, Cowboys didn't eat chips. Hey, littering. Cass, this is really important to me. I need you to take this seriously, okay? We don't have any food. We ate all the s'more stuff last night. I was hungry. Listen. I'm just trying to make sure you get the full cowboy experience. I don't want the cowboy experience. I just wanted to be with you. You're the one who likes westerns and I thought it was adorable. So when you asked me to come out here, I don't know. I thought we could get closer and that it would be just us and not some stupid cowboy rules. I know cowboys are supposed to be like lone rangers or whatever, but for this trip, I was, I was finally gonna tell you that I liked you. Whatever. I'm going home. Enjoy being a desperado. Giddy up. Cass, wait! What? Do cowboys not say giddy up? Oh, okay. I'm sorry, I just, I never knew you felt the same. I don't want to be a desperado. I want to be a cowboy with you for as long as we can, even if we're not very good at it. We can be not very good at it together. So Cass, will you do me the honors of being my riding partner through drought and storm through rustlers and riders, till rattlesnakes bite do us part. You know it's a yes. Jess? Yeah? Can we go home now? I'm covered in mosquito bites. I guess bug bite cream isn't against the cowboy code. 